Hello from Slovenia. I have this white mixed with float roll from my life on Sunday left. And I mixed some polyurethane satin varnish in, in it, water it down with water because I want to do some kind of how can I say rainbow cloudy Dutch pour I don't know how to say that I will use blow dryer but with this set in enamel I published one video not that set in enamel with um, polyurethane satin varnish you get this kind of cloudy effect uh, <clears throat> and uh, if you blow it uh, you get some nice lacing so I will try to do something like this again and I will use uh, this kind of rainbow colors and I think that I will I will start with some red this is vermilion red and my paints are mixed with my pouring medium not um, not uh, the float roll and I will add some of this carmine and some permanent magenta I will not add a lot of paint in my puddle and cadmium orange cadmium yellow yellowish green turquoise Windsor blue and permanent blue violet it's a beautiful rainbow circle I will pour some of this white around Maybe I should torch this when I saw some of you doing Dutch pours, you blow it first. Uh, you <laughs> torch it before you blow it, so.
<clears throat> you see how my paint eating this paint and I will do this see how soft this looks like a marbling let's see what will happen I just have to grab a paper towel because I have my hands messed all over To say that I like this I like this uh, thing around. I just have to push this off. I have some block. Okay. No. So let me show you a close up. I really like this middle part. Look at this lacing. this feathery look around because of <laughs> all the things that was on the canvas before but this center is just gorgeous for my taste and I will try to dip in this some more so this was again the long one, but I'm happy with, with the final result very much. So this is it for today and see you on the next one. Bye.